Welcome back to Wyoming area. You're watching live high school football on my TV, WQMY. Scranton Prep, the visitor tonight, 14-0 over Wyoming area. I'm Aaron Dugan. We thank you so much for joining us. A very familiar face to the Fox 56 sports crew. Joining me now, Andrew Kettle. Andrew, every single year it comes closer and closer. It just seems like the years are flying by for Coaches versus Cancer, and the tip-off breakfast is coming up. Tell us all about that. Yeah, we're excited for uh, November 6th, <laughs> Sunday, November 6th. It's Grand Prep for our uh, eight. Um, Coach Steve Donahue from University of Pennsylvania will be our guest speaker. And uh, just another year, um, you know, of, of everyone here in Northeast Pennsylvania getting behind this cause and, and helping fight this terrible disease. You always seem to get such great speakers, and I know it's easy for you because they really want to get involved. Yeah, and, and, you know, they really sacrifice a lot um, because the college teams are in season at that point. Um, they start uh, mid-October, and they're in season. They're practicing. They're preparing for games. And uh, for them to come two hours and join us, it just shows the dedication of the college level and uh, throughout our area, Northeast Pennsylvania, the high school level, what we've been able to do here to raise money to fight this terrible disease. Tell us more about this year's speaker. Uh, Coach Steve Donahue is, uh, has been around for a while. He coached at Boston College for a little bit, uh, Cornell, and uh, now he's back at, at University of Pennsylvania for the past few years where he started off as an assistant coach. So, uh, you know, to have him here um, in November is just another feather in our cap uh, locally with coaches. As I mentioned before, the year is just flying by. What year is this for Coaches versus Cancer? This is our ninth annual, uh, which is amazing. Uh, nine years and over a million dollars raised. Um, you know, just we can't thank everyone enough here in the community, the schools, the student athletes, the sponsors, um, Fox 56, and everyone who's really helped us bring this thing to a point where we never imagined. And any, every little bit helps for every school, but there was a couple of schools last year that really got together and did some great things. Yeah, it's amazing uh, what these students do and, and the school communities do. Um, you know, look at Elk Lake, who's gone above and beyond everyone in District 2. I think they were $25,000 last year in, um, you know, schools like Valley View, um, Scranton Prep, Abington. You can, the list is on and on. Wyoming area does a great job. Um, and, you know, we're just so uh, happy that everyone supports what we do. And, and unfortunately, we're all touched by this. And, um, you know, it's just a, another year. And, and hopefully we're closer to a cure. And Suits and Sneakers Week uh, coming up. For those who don't know, what goes on during that week and what are the dates for that? Uh, so Suits and Sneakers Week is a week-long um, games throughout the Lackawanna League and Wyoming Valley Conference, um, regular league games. Schools pick which game they want to be their coaches versus cancer game. Um, we sell T-shirts. Schools do different things to raise money um, on their own. They can come up with ideas. Coaches wear sneakers on the sidelines to raise awareness. And uh, it's just a great week of basketball. And it's come to a point now, and after nine years of doing this, that people look forward to it, and they, they circle it on their schedule. This is our Coaches versus Cancer game. brings a little bit more to the game, and um, it gives local basketball um, a really fun week. So, Andrew, did you get any funny looks coming into a football game holding a basketball? Of course I did. But this the ball was meant to be round. So, But we wanted to present this to Fox 56 tonight uh, for being our partner with Coaches versus Cancer over nine years. Really, truly exceptional what you guys do for us, giving us um, so much ability to get our message out there in our community, broadcasting games, doing commercials, having a guy like me on the sideline tonight. Um, so uh, to everyone at Fox 56 and the My Network, thank you so much. You guys are a huge part of this, and we're thrilled to be partners. Well, on behalf of the whole team, we say thank you so much, and we love being a part of Coaches vs. Cancer. Thank you very much. All right, we'll stick around. We'll have another half of great football here from Wyoming area when we come right back. You're watching live high school football on my TV, WQMY. <laughs> 